Nakuchan looks like she's in pain. She's fighting for dear life. She'll be fine. This was the last place we saw Teddy, right? He was so worried about her. I kind of hate when games and movies are like, we're really dark. Ooh, the seven year old died. And they're like, nah, never mind. She's fine. I mean, like, I don't know. It's a weird fake out. How can he flake out like this when we have to find I think mostly I just want media to be darker generally. Like, I feel like it's more. I don't like stuff that's, that's like feel good kind of stuff, you know? Like, I don't, I don't like when it's like, everything is gonna be fine. I like when it's like, sometimes things are really bad. Um, but I am glad that Oyabun is alive. I'm glad that she's okay. Because we'll I like her as a character. From here on out. Let's revisit Saki-san and Miss Yamano's incidents, and see if we can turn up fresh details. But it's been over six months. Wouldn't the trail be cold by now? I know, but we can't give up. We're the only ones who understand what's really going on. And you never know. People might remember some things now because they've had so much time to think about it. Let's split up and talk to people oh all over God. town tomorrow. We'll meet up in the evening to discuss Let's split up and talk to literally every person in town. We can find out something about Teddy, too. Yeah, I mean, I also don't like, you know, comics in the 90s, right? That were just like, we're gonna be grim and dark. Just because we're a reaction. Like, I think you gotta be saying things. I just don't think it's, um... I, don't, I guess I don't like it when, um, like, authors or showrunners or whatever, like, shy away from things being, like, bad, right? I don't like when the good guys win just because good guys always win. You know, I was thinking about the intention of experiencing, I don't want to go back and rehash the whole ending thing again, but I was thinking, I think because of the way... Because of the way that the game presents choices in that, like, getting the bad ending. So it's like, um, you get this ending, and it's not good, and it dumps you back to the beginning of the game by way of saying, you got an ending, but here's New Game Plus. I think the designer's intention is that you don't reload. Is that it's supposed to be one long, seamless narrative in which you start the game, you get whatever ending you get, you start New Game Plus, you get all the way back to the end, you do that thing again. Like, I kind of I kind of feel like that is a more, to me, and it's fucked up because it's such a long experience, but I kind of think that that's the intention. They want you to New Game Plus your way back to that point and make a different decision. Because I guess you didn't, you didn't learn the first time through. Because otherwise, what's the point of New Game Plus, right? That's the only different thing. You just get to, like, fill in the social links. And maybe the game's, like, slightly more or less difficult. Um, yeah, the only the only thing is that it gives you that opportunity to save thing, which I feel like is weird. I don't know. I'm just trying to make sense of a thing in game design that my only option is either it's bad or we find some reason why it's not. And I kind of feel like maybe, I guess, if that's not how it is, I guess it's just bad. It's just a bad choice. Not the game is bad. Obviously, it's not. Uh, okay, so let's go talk to some people. Okay, so nobody at school. Can I help you? About those murders. I still wonder what happened. It was a pretty big deal. Great, you're useless. What is it? What are you talking about? Okay, she doesn't care or remember. How about you? You got a problem? Oh, that's gas mask guy. Juness, that's right! The country of Juness is staging an all-out attack of Nineba. Man, this guy knows where it's at. This guy? Yep. You're right, man. That's a whole separate game. But that's not this game. Um... I don't need to talk to you. I need to talk to you. That's a bird. Reset came and spoke to me. 
it doesn't, you're nothing. All these people are such pointless idiots. Hey, good, I got a bug catching net. Do not tell me about how to fucking catch bugs. Annoying kid can't play soccer. Freaked out about poison. Ugh, I didn't like this part when I, ooh, what's up, gas mask man? Why am I outside? When I'm at home, I see more news about the murders. I thought I'd stay outside and watch the sunset. Of course, I'm gonna watch TV when I go home anyway. Even then, I can't see the sunset because of all this fog. I hate it, it's so depressing. Oh, come on, don't make me more depressed. The whole thing's over. Okay, so nobody here worth talking to. Tell me about murders. You don't know about murders. You're a quest person. Here, I have a cabbage. No one cares. Alright, down to Samigawa. So quest people are not giving me information. My daughter was in an accident. On top of that, it was a hit and run. Nobody could tell what kind of car it was because of all the fog. Oh, okay. So there's like a specific order in which I need to talk to these people. Why? Fog sure is dark and creepy. Oh, you have a question for me? A little while ago, they said the suspect had been caught. It was in the newspaper. It was that namatame son, right? I remember seeing him around from time to time. How horrible. It does frighten me. I don't recall seeing any other strange people, so I'm sure he's the culprit. Is it true there were no other suspicious individuals? Perhaps you'd ask someone else about this. Okay. So now I have, I have to ask someone else. Who should I ask? Someone else. Someone else. Alright, let's go. For everyone's safety of mind, I'm just gonna do these in the correct order and not pretend like I don't know there's an order. Can I help you? Do you recall anyone suspicious? Now that you mention it, my friend was saying she saw someone that might have been a communist. Which is wandering around the shopping district. When you ask her, fuck off. So weird. This is, I mean, it's exactly the same. It's a longer, so to be fair, the game taught us how to do this because it's a longer version of the um, find information bits uh, when you have to go and rescue someone. Uh, let's see. Somewhere near the bookstore. Okay, do you recall someone suspicious? Someone told you I saw a suspicious person? Uh, oh, that. You remember Saki Kanishi, don't you? Well, I heard her reading out loud from a copy of the Communist Manifesto. She said something about Das Kapital. You should definitely talk to her. She told me how Namatami person came to her one day and started spreading all this craziness about the TV. I wonder what that was all about. His relation to Saki? Uh, I don't know, some kind of specter haunting Europe? I know you're implying, but you got it all wrong. Saki was a good girl. She must be referring to the time when Namatami went to warn Saki. Seems like the thing about Namatami making advances on Saki was a misunderstanding. You don't say. Alright, now the next part is talk to literally everyone. Wow.
Not that guy. Kanjo? We're just checking boxes in a database now. Re reviewing information we already know. Which, you know, whatever. Well, they gave me some money. Oh, for finishing that quest. Well, that's nice. Hmm, I'm impressed by your kindness, boy. I think I understand you, but... Okay, you want some fine coal? Do I have any on me already? No. Okay. Yeah, city castles. Sure. Okay. Uh, we're pretty done with this area. Yeah, it's funny because you're you're talking to people and they just say nothing. Like they're just like, no, I don't know. I don't know anything about this. Nobody knows anything about it. in an accident. My granddaughter is a Yakuza. Do you need anything? Tell me about these murders. Oh, This kind man is so kind. I had a lot of people come to our store, but it wasn't anyone suspicious. Cat, what do you know about this? Useless. Do you need something? The town was a buzz last spring. It doesn't seem like you're gonna find any more information. Is that what you just said? Doesn't look like... Okay, good. So I guess I'm done. So now I can go to Juness. Oh, there we go. Okay. So it does It does warn you. Chinese diner. Aya, ah, yeah. you met with your friends after you finished gathering information. <sighs> I'm seriously so pooped. pooped. This stuff's a lot harder when you don't have a badge to flash. I walked around all day and didn't hear anything good. It was the same for me. There was absolutely no talk about the case whatsoever, let alone the true culprit. Ditto for me. Actually, in my case, I kept getting bombarded with questions and couldn't get them onto the main subject at all. <sighs> the killer must be pretty good to have pulled this off without being seen by anyone in this small town. What should we do? Well, one steak bowl, please! That's not what I meant. But then again, I guess we might as well take a break. I'll have a crab and egg fried rice. I'll have roast pork ramen with extra noodles. Mm, yeah, Kanji. You even got good taste in food. Oh, now that our tummies are full, let's share what we learned. Even if it wasn't Fucking much. nothing. Jack shit. So, to sum up, there really was no new information. The yes. end? The police had an unusually large number of officers in their initial investigation of the first two incidents. To find facts that even they overlooked would be difficult indeed, now that over half a year has passed. There wasn't a single report of suspicious persons being witnessed to begin with. Miss Yamano had ardent fans, whereas Saki-san didn't. But otherwise, the conditions are the same. You know, every time I tried to ask about the case, everyone ignored me and kept ranting about the damn fog. Yeah, that or the Midnight Channel. I asked around about Teddy, too, but no one's seen him. Gee... I wonder where he could have gone. 
Do you have anything, Naoto? Nothing. <sighs> Without any new data to work with, there isn't so much I can do. So what the fuck was the point of all that shit? Like, just... Hold your fucking horses. Why? Why? Why did that even happen? Why did it make me do that? I talked to everyone, learned nothing. We just had a five minute conversation about n not knowing anything. Well, I don't. But there must be someone in town who Why? needs the criteria for this case. The killer must <laughs> have a connection to both Saki-san and Miss Yamano. Whatever. I'm not mad as at it. It's just weird. In a position to observe our actions periodically to some extent. Finally, it must be someone who could approach Senpai's house without arousing suspicion. It's Adachi. It's fucking Adachi. I need some fresh air before I give it more thought. Yeah, it's true. The game taught me to run around and do all that. It's snowing. No wonder it's chilly. It's the inverse of... never mind. Ugh, it's freezing out here. Maybe this will help clear my head and get my deductive muscles flexing. Hey, is it snowing? Yes. It's... Too bad the fog's so thick. The snow just gets lost in it. Yuki ga furu. Must be something that's been overlooked. It's urgent to get over the roadblock facing you. The clues you need must already be in your hands. What's the matter? You should go over everything you know. One more time. The culprit had some kind of connection to both Mayumi Yamano and Saki Konishi. Judging by the warning letters, the culprit most likely knows about the other side and what you did there. It's highly likely they also knew what Namatami was doing and stood back to watch. Who would know all these things? Another oddity about the case is there were almost no witnesses. Both warning letters seemed to have been delivered directly to your house, but no one saw anyone suspicious. No one unusual was seen around Mayumi Yamano or Saki Konishi either, despite the police dispatching an unusually high number of officers to perform a thorough investigation. There must be someone in this small town who fits all the facts. The person who seems to be the most likely culprit is... Someone else. Someone else. Someone else just gives you everyone you've ever met. <laughs> so is this one of those like huge choices or does this not matter? Right? The game the game is giving me binary decisions now. They're either the most important decision or they're totally irrelevant. So am I about to game over myself again? I'm thinking it's Adachi. That's my feelings. Where is that asshole? There he is. Adachi Toru-san. Right, so it matters a lot. It's so stupid. <laughs> I'm going with Adachi, that's my choice. Of course, if you look only at the circumstances, you can't completely rule out that possibility. Adachi may have been able to keep an eye on your actions. He would have been able to approach your house with ease, and he knows the area well. Thinking about it, you encountered him many times while investigating the case. You learn much about the police's movements from Adachi as well. There's no exact reason to doubt him, but something is bothering you. Yeah, he's a totally shitty cop. Huh? What about him? Detective Adachi. Hmm. A member of the police force. That is an interesting approach. It would certainly explain the lack of witness reports. It's the same reason no one ever reported seeing Namatame's truck. This is a small town, so everyone must have known who he is. And since he's a detective, people definitely wouldn't have thought of him as being suspicious. In fact, he could use his position to his advantage and hide critical information. Huh. Well, if you think of it that way, I guess it's possible. But we're talking about Adachi here, right? I mean, really? Adachi? He's your textbook lousy detective. Are we really on the right track here? Actually, regarding Detective Adachi, I'm not sure how to put it, but there's something that's been bothering me about They recorded a lot of dialogue for someone who might not be the murderer. He's totally the murderer. Yeah? Hmm. Perhaps it's just my imagination, so I shouldn't speak to... <laughs> Gesundheit. It's cold. 
I think we've cooled down enough here. Let's go back in. Do 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 do. Adachi-san? That can't be. I mean, he said he came to escort Ms. Yamano and... What? Was he at your inn when the announcer was staying there? When Miss Yamano was staying at our inn, the media were swarming all over it. That's when Adachi-san arrived, saying he'd been assigned to guard her. He told our waitress that fame could be rough. Guard her? He didn't spend the night there? Hmm. I wonder if he knew Ms. Yamano. I don't know about that, but I heard he did call out to a girl in my class. I found out this afternoon. But I thought, you know, that's just how cops are. So I didn't think it had anything to do with the case. Detective Adachi also questioned Saki-san, the one who found the announcer's body, on numerous occasions. Her voice sounds a little like, she sounds a little like Uma Thurman. I heard it was because there was so little information about the I mean, the obviously it's not, time, but it but sounds a bit like her. It's certainly unusual to question someone with as strong an alibi as hers multiple times. Then you think he had something else you on his think? mind? You <sighs> think? And that something is what connects those two victims to Adachi-san? Come to think of it, we've been running into that guy a lot. You know, and every time he'd tell us what the police were doing before saying, oops, I said too much and clamming up. Was that all to throw us off the trail? It would be no problem for him to drop that warning letter into your mailbox either. Not to mention the fact that he can destroy any evidence that might point to him. Various peculiarities have begun to cast a suspicious shadow on Adachi. Then... Is it really Adachi-san? Uh... Yeah... See, again, is this like a hard decision thing, or can I just choose? I mean, I, we need to confirm this, right? This is still only a tentative theory. We should work to confirm it as soon as possible. This is Naoto Shiragane. Something has occurred to me about the case, and I'd like to get Detective Adachi's input on it. Huh? The transport? It's right now? Right, I, I see. Thank you. What was that about a transport? Detective Adachi is headed to the hospital to prepare for Namatame's relocation. We must head there at once. Things are moving quickly now. You feel getting closer to the truth. I can't all my social links go this fast. Also, we're, we're back at the beginning of the game. We're back in the like three hours of not really doing anything part of the game. <laughs> What's up, Murdler? Huh? What are you guys doing here? Hey, do you know where Dojima-san went? They told me he snuck out of his I'm room again. sneak into your face with my fist! I assure you, we've made it clear to him several times that he needs to stay put, but he keeps going off on his own. Jeez, with Namatami finally relocated, I was looking forward to going home. So, he's been relocated. I've been wondering. You seem to be in a terrible hurry to get him out of this hospital. Huh? Oh, well, yeah. I mean, we can't leave him here with Dojima-san and Nanako-chan around. Man, I wonder how yeah, Dojima so feels too. about being, um, uh, sleeping with the enemy. Hey, what are you doing here anyway? Don't you think you should leave before Dojima-san finds you? If he catches you, he'll start pestering you again. Adachi. Where's Namatami? There's been a lot of noise today for some reason. Dojima-san! What are you doing here? Namatami's already been relocated. I was looking for you so I could tell you that. You did what? Who authorized that? There's still more I need to ask Oh shit. About. Give me a break, Dojima-san. Those first two murders have been bothering me. Well, if you're not bothered by murder, it's probably a good sign you shouldn't be a cop. Is shaky and his alibi is rock solid. We closed a lot of loopholes on the basis of his testimony. But that part's still nagging at me. Is this more of your detective's intuition? He's already been relocated. 
It's no use hassling me about it. <laughs> Bake him away, toys. <laughs> and you kids should really get home too. You're gonna get Oh, now you're a station. serious police officer, huh? Yeah? Yeah? Now you are? What's gotten into you today? It's odd to see you taking work so seriously. Come on. I'm always giving 110% when it comes Not to the true. job. You should get back to work too, Dojima-san. Your current assignment? Get better as soon Shut as possible. Shut up. Yeah. What are you all doing here? We came to confirm something with Adachi-san. You should question Adachi. The time the announcer went missing? I can't say for sure offhand. It's not like I saw oh, anything. Yeah. That was months and months ago, too. My memory's kind of hazy that far back. Tell me again. <laughs> he just says the same thing. Okay. Why wouldn't I question her? She discovered the announcer's body. But she didn't know much about it, so I only talked with her once or twice. Was that all you wanted to ask? Well, I hope it helped. There's still something you need to question Adachi about. Warning letter? The one that was delivered to his house. It's in police custody now, correct? Uh, I don't really remember. I don't really remember. Or hey, what do you mean know you anything? Remember? I gave it to you to take down to the crime lab for processing. You're telling me you forgot? <laughs> I'm sorry. Your accident was right after that. And what with one thing and another? It's oh my sort of God. Besides, that thing was just a yeah, like just lost it? some important evidence. No big deal. Jeez, what are you asking me all this for? For crying out loud, what's this all supposed to be about? I'm freaking out. Dojima-san, you really need to get back to your bed. That's why your wounds aren't healing. And you all need to go home right now. Do you have any idea what it's time It's high is? noon. I'm going back. I need to get to the station and report in. Just one more thing, please. <laughs> we know for certain now that the first two murders weren't Namatame's doing. Someone else bum, killed bum, them. Bum. Adachi san, do you have any idea who that might be? I have no idea Bullshit. what you're talking about. Because we think it might have been you. What? That's ridiculous. We already know Namatami's the one who So, put them all how in. far are we from getting the like what, what did I'll you tell say? you everything. Yeah, he just fucked up. You fucked up, man. Put them You all done in. goofed. What's this putting them in business? Do you know something about the method behind the murders? Dun, dun. Don't tell me that all that talk about TVs and whatnot from before was I see. Now I finally understand. To tell the truth, Adachi-san, I've been fixated on something you once said. Before, I didn't know why, only that it sounded a wrong note to me. Do you recall when I read Namatame's diary? At the scene of Dojima-san's accident. At the time, I said, even the victims who That's survived right. and were never released to the public are written here. And in response, your words were, wow, then that settles it. How, I wonder, would that settle anything? At the time, the police had no idea that there had been other attempted murders related to the case. You had no reason to say such a thing. After all, there are countless examples of people disappearing for a few days. Yet when I read the list of names, you raised no objection. Odd, that. What do you say to that, Detective Adachi? I don't know. God, I love the body animations. I said I'm busy! Shut up! I have to go police some stuff! Wait, you son of a bitch! Yeah, get him, Kanji. And then Kanji accidentally kills him. Adachi! Oh, damn it. Curse these... Adachi! Addled brains. <laughs> Falls down. Oh, shit. Where'd he go? Namatami's hospital room. Adachi isn't here, either. I swear he ran this oh, way. Oh, that's you know. Terebini. Do 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 do. Damn it! Where the hell did he go? 
Did you find him? What do you mean, where did he go? He either went out the window Contact or into the TV. The There's only two places he could have gone. So he must be still in this ward somewhere. He's oh my here. god, you're all so and fucking we dense. We didn't find him anywhere. That bastard. <clears throat> Dojima-san, for heaven's sake, what are we going to do with you? Sorry. I got carried away. Do you even want to get better? If you keep this up, there could be lasting damages. Have you forgotten how much trouble it caused Listen, you Dojima, last time? if my experience... If my experience with nurses is anything like your experience with nurses is going to be, you want to go with this lady, because she's going to treat you good. You're right. Sorry. See? Yeah. You've got to find Adachi. I need to square this away with him. Wait until the Normos leave, and then boop, into the television. Get out of here, Normos! He hasn't left this ward yet? I don't think he would, but... Yes! Could... Yeah, I think so. Could and did! If he's the killer, he can go through... Oh right? my god, just get in the fucking TV. He went in through here? We searched every inch in the direction he ran off. There's nowhere to hide. I don't think we could have Oh, you nerds, him. just do it. He was cornered. It's highly probable that he escaped there. If he does indeed turn up on the other side, that should prove beyond a doubt that he is the true culprit. Come on. So I guess we were right. What do we do now? Fucking, let's just get him. Get in the fucking TV. I think it's too oh dangerous to go in from here. We're not 100% positive he used this TV. And on top of that, we don't know where That's it might fine. lead. Let's go in from Jeunesse like always. It'll be fine. So long as we're ready for him, we'll crush that jerk in one strike. He's going to be like the horrible god king of that realm. You've taken another step closer to the truth. Arbitrary social link. Well, you know, what is important is that I get to go home and make some more envelopes. You know, I'm sure we've got lots of time to pursue the culprit later, right? All right, well let's um, let's let's put her let's put her to bed here, and uh, we'll uh, we'll come back and fold envelopes again tomorrow. <laughs>